St. Kitts and Nevis Prime Minister Terence Drew has called on his predecessor to explain the hundreds of fraudulent marriages that occurred when he was in power. Drew said the former thousands upon thousands of dollars. And this is how it works. You come, you're married, you divorce, you marry again, and then you pass it, you pass on the citizenship here, there, and everywhere. That is how it works, Madam Speaker. And then the, those persons who are involved in it, they say, well, you know, $3,000. Then they get divorced and they're looking for a next marriage because that's another quick $3,000. Sorry, I was talking to Mitch. Uh, no. Sorry. Mitch, hello. Three, two, one. Well, St. Kitts and Nevis Prime Minister Dr. Terence Drew has called on his predecessor to explain the hundreds of fraudulent marriages that occurred when he was in power. Drew said the former Prime Minister, Dr. Timothy Harris, who had responsibility for immigration, had a lot to answer for as he revealed what he said was an illegal marriage ring in the Federation. Prime Minister Drew told Parliament that under the scheme, which was perpetrated by members of the Spanish community, were people who were getting citizenship and voting rights. Thousands upon thousands of dollars. And this is how it works. You come, you're married, you divorce, you marry again, and then you pass, it, you pass on the citizenship here, there, and everywhere. That is how it works, Madam Speaker. And then the, those persons who are involved in it, they say, well, you know, $3,000. Then they get divorced and they're looking for a next marriage because that's another quick three thousand dollars. Now Drew said he had met with members of the Latino community in St. Kitts about the issue. I had a meeting with the community because, as I said, we're going to treat people humanely. But I told them this is what we uncovered and discovered, and therefore we cannot continue that path. It's a whole ring where we were even being questioned to be part of human trafficking.